Juicy. Oh, you still taking up for Biggie, huh? Yo, fuck with Biggie. I'm just saying. You, s I mean, what you mean after Diddy or something? Hey, brother. Hey. No, nah, I'm saying, is that what you're saying? All right, I'm about to play you a, because you, you you can't you can know oh what I'm saying. Oh my god, you about to play one line out of a million that Biggie said about just somebody to talk shit about somebody father daughter daughter father excuse me about somebody daughter father. Then he say like I fuck your dad. I, no 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 no. He said you look so good. I yeah. suck your daddy's dick. It was the nineties, bro. <laughs> and and when niggas say that shit, I don't know one nigga that <laughs> joked around <laughs> talking about. Hey man, you look 90s. so good, man. I pull your dad's pants down. And but it probably was a New York slang though. I ain't never hear Wu Tang say that shit, God. I ain't never hear Dipset say that shit, yo. I ain't never hear no Rough Riders ever say I'm sucking on another nigga dick, b. If, they the they the biggest motherfucking. It's they, probably they, New York slang. Come on, bro. Oh, you really gonna shit on Biggie just for that? I ain't saying shit on him. I'm just I just so, had. You know. Nigga, I said one thing about Biggie. You went all the way to the motherfucking right or the left. Like goddamn, like. I'm just saying. I'm I'm just saying. I'm we just still, saying. I'm just giving. I just said, fuck all you hoes, just like Biggie said. Like Next Biggie. thing you know, this nigga want to start <laughs> off with, oh, so you still fuck with Biggie? Like, goddamn! <laughs> God, can I still quote Biggie? I mean, shit, <laughs> shit now, I mean, nowadays, did, that shit like... He did make a song called Juicy, which uh, it was a uh, Diddy's idea. It you remember the movie? He played a beat, Juicy. And he was like, and he, and he wow, was, he was like, he was like, yeah. he was like, what the fuck? He said, what's wrong yeah. with you? <laughs> He's they like, said, he said, juicy. He said, nah, nigga. That's when, you know what I'm saying, he brought the baby oil and shit out of, you know, they ain't gonna show it behind the scenes and shit. Hey, you know what I'm saying? was wild, the Nigga bro. had a Why whole talk. Why that song? Juicy. <laughs> like, what? Out of all the beats, all the songs, you it's could It's a classic. Choose. It's a whole classic. Had the niggas rap the whole song, if you ain't know the song. But you remember in the movie, uh, Biggie was like, not really trying to rap. And then one day he just stepped in there. He's like, fuck it. Yeah. Yeah, so it took him a while. He was like... He was basically on a... He was like, you know, uh, a yeah. local rapper. Yeah. But he actually took it serious. Yeah. Type but I'm shit. just saying, when they brought him... It's like, bruh, you, it's time to go to the major leagues. Yeah, yeah, because he and, kept and on... And it's the first... The nigga got throw me. I'm about to say it. Like, they were, God damn, like, what the fuck? They, they was having freestyle battles and cyphers, you know what I'm saying, on the block. Niggas heard Biggie, and he'll bring crowd. He'll bring other neighborhoods to Brooklyn. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just to hear Biggie. And they was like, yo, what, what is you doing? Like, you playing yeah, around yeah, right you now. You need to take it serious. You need playing around. And it always takes something to happen, which a nigga got caught with a gun. Biggie said, take it. I'm not, you know, yeah, nigga, they, they was, was like, like yeah, I'm all in. Yeah, he was yeah, like, bro, yeah. you are the, he said, you are the prize, bro. And academics, you know what I'm saying? But you know what I mean. Yeah. He's like, you, you the hit it right now, bro. You top dog. You going to do this for us. You see what's about to happen. I'm about to go to jail. I'm about to take the rap for us. Yeah. You know what I mean? And, you know, do your thing. Just make sure you do your thing. And Biggie did. It always take police shit. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Street shit. I mean, you, get, you know what I'm saying? Get stupid, serious. Man, just like, why so late? But now, nah, man. That right. boy retarded. <laughs> but nah, man. That boy right, in a slow get, class. Let's get into it. We, we talk, but. Uh, yeah, oh, yeah, shit. Man. man, what's up? What's up, y'all? You know what I mean? Yeah, man. We, we just, we, we, this, this is what go on all the time. We just be back and forth talking about shit. That go on. And but, this week, last month, last decade, it don't matter. It's just a whole yeah, bunch man. of shit, man. What you say? We're the two dumbest niggas on TV. Two dumbest niggas, man. <laughs> DJ 320, WAP TV, yes, Shop with WAP. You already know which way, you know what I mean? Yeah, man. Man. Duvet. Always tell a friend, tell another friend. Shout out to y'all for tuning in. Now, it's a lot of shit that went down. So, are you ready? For these topics, are y'all ready for these topics? Because shit is about to get real. Man, I repeat a dolphin. I'm ready, man. 
Let's get it. Justice for Dolph, man. They done finally got justice for Dolph. We finally know the truth. We you know, know what we've been, you well, know, we've been, we, we know, been man, but now we know. Been told us now we happened. know details. We man. know numbers. 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 Man. Niggas out here killing niggas for car notes, bro. Man. So, all right. The first the number. They said, Big Jug, if you don't know who Big Jug is, Yo Gotti's brother, who recently, recently just got killed at a funeral, which is crazy. It's crazy. But, yeah. I mean, it wasn't recently, but a couple months ago. Recent enough. Yeah, recent enough. Got killed at a funeral. He put a hundred K on Dolph head, man. One hundred K. I'm like, bro, you put a hundred on Dolph, man? A hundred. Niggas went down on the numbers, turned it into 40. Turned into 40, nigga broke it down. Turned into... Ten, I think it went to 10. Or 20. 20, yeah, 20. Yeah, 20, talking about y'all y'all split that shit or whatever. Y'all split, yeah, y'all yeah, split, yeah, split, yeah, 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 you split with your partners. And then the like, nigga went down. They already on some janky shit. You should have right. known they was on some janky shit right. already, bro. That's, you that's, starving that's, that that's, much, bro? They gave, they gave you 800 <laughs> Dollars, bro? It made me think about Memphis, bro. That's what I thought like, about. I was like, yeah, that's a fucked up city. Yeah, I'm like, like that's a fucked up fuck. city, bro. And niggas have like, no thinking process out there. Like, this is my thing about when niggas be like hitting top dogs and just hitting niggas that's known, you know what I'm saying, with status yeah. and shit like that. How the fuck are you going to enjoy the money that you get? You either going to go to jail or you're going to be in somebody's next blunt. That's what I felt about the Julio killers. Like, y'all did all that and then. A couple of days later, y'all in jail. In jail, lit. Like, and that shit didn't take no time. Y'all ain't even get the ball. Y'all ain't even get to go shopping. Y'all ain't even smell that motherfucking money. Like, they ain't even. They ain't even hold them up for twenty four hours. Damn man, is it free straight drop? He like, hey, Fizzle like, said that shit. Hey, Fizzle, Fizzle said, said free straight Fizzle drop. Fizzle said that they, shit. They want their revenge. <laughs> they ain't gotta tell them. They know what this shit means. <laughs> you know, what's, you know, what shit going on. But <laughs> back crazy. to this shit though, man. Yeah, like. Man. They should have just and that and that's another and shit. CMG some janky motherfuckers. CMF, CMF, fat cocaine that, music beeps. That's because you know I we can't CMF. use the f word yeah, nowadays. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, CMF, cocaine music, cocaine music beeps. But yeah, man, you was saying though they some they some yeah because of the fact how the fuck nigga gonna be like hundred k and then say oh price drop now it's forty k. Price drop. Oh, now it's twenty. Now it's twenty k. Man, out. It was it Juk that dropped the price, or it was like he put the price, I and think then other was, niggas took I, the I took think, the money and was like, oh, I could finesse this nigga, and then you know it kept dropping. I don't. I mean, like you give me the money. If the nigga that put out the hit, it, it seemed to me he has to be the one that being charged of uh, changing the numbers. Oh, yeah, you know what I mean. That makes sense. And the reason why I just say fuck the, that whole clue, just because of the fact that. I'm sure Juk went to Gotti and told him. And Gotti knew about that's that. That's what I'm shit, saying. Man. That's what I'm saying, bro. Ass, bro. Like, that shit wild as shit. And he, you know, gave him that brother talk and was like, look, you know what come with this shit. You know what I mean? Uh, and the nigga was like, yeah, but, you know, he's like, all right, I can't help you, you know, when shit, you know what I'm saying, go left. But, hey, you know, he was with it all the way, point blank. And it just. It, it just so much with that situation, like, yeah, it, 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 and, and like yeah, now they got and they got videos and you know what I mean, more and more details and it just makes the whole situation fucked up, make you mad all over again. It make me really mad because it's like, bro, eight hundred dollars, bro. Y'all doing all that shit just to kill one of the biggest niggas in that motherfucker. If not the biggest nigga, and it's the fact the that the niggas. niggas from Memphis, and you know what impact Dolph had on Memphis, and like, and them niggas, some of them niggas like was around, like it's a picture of straight. Oh yeah, yeah, around them niggas, yeah, 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 yeah like bro, close by, know, like type shit. That's some wild, whole ass, a whole nigga, whole ass nigga for eight hundred dollars, like, bro. The nigga could have gave you game and all that shit to get your own hundred k plus. You from his, you from his neck of the woods. You was in the circle at one point. I'm sure the nigga Man. knows your face. Memphis is so much of a big city. Man, I be feeling like Memphis. I mean, honestly, they say it's not a big city. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah I said it's such. I said it's such. Like, it's it's not like really a big city. Yeah, yeah but, that's what but I mean. it has like you know, it's supposed to be a big city. Right. Kinda, you know what I'm saying? It's supposed to be because it's like one of the main cities in Tennessee. But it's like the nigga uh, Key Glock said, you could get anywhere in Memphis 
in 25 minutes. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. That's bro. crazy. So basically, they <laughs> had to drop. D- Dolph was around Memphis. They was like, where? Just ride around looking for his car. You can, Basically, you can find anybody in 25, 30 minutes. That's wild. That's wild as shit. That's wild. I'm like, do y'all even have traffic? <laughs> the fuck? Crazy. <laughs> like, crazy. <laughs> but now, nah, man, it's like, bruh. So they finally convicted this nigga straight drop. And they paid for the lawyer 50000 Damn. They paid the lawyer 50000 So you ain't even... Damn. That's crazy. Niggas shitting on niggas. Wait, who paid for that? CMF paid for that? They did. You're lying. They did. Wow. Yeah. They on, they on bread ass now. Oh. Yeah, it's a lot of shit. Yeah, so it's just more and more shit going down. Wait, was he ever signed to them niggas or... I just yeah. said... No. He wanted money. He was just the fucking crash out. It's wild as shit, bro, right? It blows me, bro. It they blows really me, took bro. Dolph life over for, eight, all, for nothing. Eight hundred dollars. Nothing. Not even a thousand dollars, bro. Not even a thousand. Not even a thousand dollars, bro. A hundred thousand ain't even enough. It's bro. not. And this nigga it's really not. did all that just for oh my. Eight hundred dollars. Didn't even get a nigga a stack. That just shows just how much this, fucking respect they got for you, just bro. Just for these niggas to be in court telling on each other. The first day. Hey, that like, shit even went, that shit shouldn't even went to trial. I'm like, bro, y'all niggas really did all that so-called gangster shit just to go tell right after. Y'all probably was the same niggas in the streets talking about. Well, oh, I ain't never telling you, man. Niggas hoes for telling you. I ain't go, man. Man, I ain't even gonna hold you, bro. I was fucking around listening to Six Nine, bro. That Gotti Gotti, that shit hard. I ain't even gonna lie to you, bro. Hey, fuck you, mean I'm wild. Y'all niggas gotta stop being hypocrites about the snitches and rats. Man, nah, for real though. Like seriously, nah, for real. Though. Nah, seriously. Nah, for real. Just, like nah, for real. It's like, bro. Like I was telling you, like a couple of days on the phone, bro. Y'all niggas think like only niggas that's not from the street. Snitch. Oh yeah, it'd be snitching. You'd be like, yeah. nah, it'd be the street it'd niggas, it'd be the street hard niggas, niggas. It'd, it'd be the tough it'd be, niggas. You it'd know? be the niggas that committed the crimes, been in the streets their whole life, killer rats, been so called. They they told them the code, what to do, what not to do. Yeah. Those be the same niggas that snitching. Cause once they get in jail, they start realizing, oh shit, I don't want to be here. Oh shit, I can't do this. I can't do this for days. How am I gonna do this for years? They yeah, start realizing wild. like, I'm what the? To, f- I'm about to go ahead. I was about to show you. I gotta show uh, you this uh <coughs> this post. You can read it if you want to. But nah. Every single young nigga be watching this dog trial, a bunch of broke ass niggas killed one millionaire on behalf of another millionaire for a hundred K that none of them niggas ever got and now every single every single person involved is telling on each other. Really sums up the streets. Man, that's a direct quote. That's basically what I'm saying summed up. I know. Like, bro. That's why I said that. Niggas, that's crazy as niggas shit, right? Niggas in the streets is like, bro. I don't know if it's the education level or if niggas just... It's the respect level. It's the niggas, the morals. Niggas ain't got no morals. Niggas just all fucked up. And it's just... But the so-called street code yeah, is like you're yeah, supposed to have morals and you're supposed to... Yeah. Da, 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 da. And niggas is not following them, co- them codes. That's what really is going on. Nope. Them so-called codes, them niggas code, don't really shits, follow All them shits is being broken. Because if you, if you really think about it, that slime shit should not be going on if niggas is following the codes. Why should a nigga want to slime a nigga out if you're supposed to have a nigga back? Right. Like... All that shit. Just and words. It, yeah, all that shit. It this don't make sense, man. Shit is all talk. Niggas is just broke, desperate. All talk. Just trying to find a way out. To get $800. Bruh, but it's like, you don't even think like... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They don't think further like $800. What the fuck is $800 really going to do for you, bruh? Bruh. I'm talking about longevity-wise. Because now you got niggas on your ass. How broke did you have to be to like, one eight hundred? That's the question. That's so the motherfucking question. One eight hundred dollars, bro. Cause what would you do for twenty? Twenty thousand. Man, shit, man, this is out this joint. Crazy, bro. Wicked, wicked, wicked. Man, they finished that trial so fast, bro. <laughs> 
they finished that motherfucker so fast. They like, man, we got what we need. Yeah. <laughs> guilty, guilty, guilty. Y'all niggas going to jail. Fuck y'all niggas. Man, I wonder how much time they going to give them. They said life. Oh, they said life? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Damn. Good for his ass. Yeah, man. Fuck straight drop. Man. Nigga got life, snitch, and still got life. Damn. That's crazy. Damn. That's crazy. Damn. That's crazy, bro. You snitch for life. <laughs> you snitch just to get life. Now the nigga gonna be in jail trying to get the pills. Yeah, I'm a good behavior, good citizen. Nah, he wanna be a good citizen all of a sudden. Yeah, I don't know what the streets look convert like. Convert to Muslim. <laughs> I'm doing a lot. <laughs> I'm doing a lot and shit like that. He already, like, looked, he already looked like he about to do it. You man. can tell that's the next step. He about to find the, the, the first arc he see in that motherfucker. Hey, I need protection, protection, nigga. They know who the fuck I am. <laughs> they gonna have nothing. I'm gonna be like this. <laughs> a lot doesn't judge for real. So, you know, you might have to run into the right arc that, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Man, that you know, really, you look for the right arc in you know that what I'm saying? Like yeah, man. but if you find an arc that was a doll fan, bro, like, more power to you. More power to you. <laughs> more man. power to you. But that's all man, we trying. Man. We had to get that off our chest because yeah, man, yeah. niggas in the streets, man. Y'all gotta start thinking, man. It is wild, bro. Just too much. To, it was too much connecting the dots. Like the first day, the first week for real. Man, and niggas already knew what happened the first week, man. The first week, bro. I think it's probably niggas saw them niggas like, oh, that's yeah. that straight drop, and that's him right there shooting. Like niggas probably saw that shit while they was shooting, like. Oh, we know who that shooting. They got the camera. Yeah. It was 20 shots, bro. Like, damn, 20 man. shots, bro. Damn, man. Like, they wanted to make sure. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't just like no pop, pop. Like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And the nigga shoot back type shit. But. <sighs> man. That shit frustrate me, man. It is. R.I.P. Dolph, man. R.I.P. Dolph, man. We come it's on. like, damn, yeah. bro. I know. He was on his way too, and God, he knew that shit. That's why they, yeah, yeah they, they knew, man, they knew that. That's why niggas, when niggas be praising God, he for the new shit he done. I'm like, bro, y'all don't understand. This nigga's a hoe, bro. This nigga oh, really oh. was hating on Dolph just because the nigga fucked his baby. <laughs> no, he didn't want to sign to CMG. That's bro. what it was. He didn't want to sign to CMG. But if you think about this, that's what he did. This shot, he backdoor shot. Cause shot ain't signed to CMG. Exactly, bro. He backdoor shot. Made ni other niggas take his chain and get the chain back. Yeah. So that might be a move for him then. You know, put put himself in a situation. People Did you know about, about Black Youngster before that chain? No. Oh, okay. And get the chain back. So quick, so fast. Didn't even have to pay the nigga to get the shit well, back. Uh, we was like, nah, we're going to do that shit off the strength, big bro. Like, don't even wear a black. What was that line? Uh, Shot said he was like, I ain't signed to him, nigga. Something, something, something like that, but he already. Oh, shot, yeah, I, yeah, he did. Yeah, he, oh. Nah, he said. And I some I forgot exactly what it was, but he was talking about not signing to them niggas, cause he knew he was like, "What the fuck? Like these niggas right. took my chain just and so they could get, get me to sign. I mean, just so they could get me to sign." We don't do that to each other. Like we supposed to be homies. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I fuck with Gotti. Like I fucked with Gotti to where it's the point I would have done anything for him, anything. You know what I'm saying? So it's like that shit kind of was. That shit made me look at the whole game different. I started moving. Fuck, you know, I, it been fuck these niggas, but after that, it's like, man, fuck you niggas. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit crazy, bro. Yeah. Gotti been doing whole shit. Mm -hmm. Like, man, that nigga really a hoe. He tried to sign Dolph. Dolph ain't want to sign. So, he put him in these situations, man. That he had to be in, but it's like, fuck you. Fuck yeah. everything about you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I know you try to get me... Sh like, you know what I mean? I know what it is. But if you think about it, bro, this really started over a bitch, bro. <laughs> nigga fucked the nigga baby mom, man. That's what it was? I mean, the sign of shit was a part of it, but it was like when the nigga fucked the nigga baby mom... Hurt it, his pride and it, shit. It hurt, man, it hurt the nigga, man. Don't play with me. Play with your bitch. Man, it hurt That's the nigga, That's a hit right man. there. It hurt the nigga, bro. And, I feel and the like nigga was just going off on the job, man. Shout out to the cocaine music fan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I shit fucked was... your bitch. Like, all that shit, man. It hurt that nigga, man. It was just like how Biggie was listening to Hit Him Up when Pac dropped that shit. Bruh, that shit be hurting niggas' feelings, man. Niggas yeah. talk about niggas don't get hurt about these bitches, but that shit hurt niggas, man. I don't, ain't yeah. even no low key about it, yeah, as you can man. see. Yeah. Don't get this shit confused, man. Don't listen to them niggas that talk that just say the words. Bruh. Talking about money over hoes and da 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 da. Man, 
Don't fuck listen to none of that shit. shit. Fuck all that shit. Niggas be having feelings behind closed doors. <laughs> Gangsters be having feelings, man. <laughs> man, niggas be having feelings behind I'm, closed doors. I'm man. saying though, bro, if you co- if just if your so called girl fucked another nigga or whatever, that's not your girl, bro. Man, that's not your girl. The nigga trouble trouble died over a bitch. Bro. I know. Nigga went in there, saw his baby. Uh, seen, his, seen, I don't know yeah. if his baby mama, but his girl. And seen so, another nigga car type shit. Man, niggas yeah. killed the nigga, bro, and got back that same day, that same night. Crazy. Like, nigga ain't even, he did it knowing this he, shit was going to come back. And he just knew that, yeah, I just had to, yeah. Killed the nigga over a bitch, bro. I didn't even want him. Bro, I, evidently. I fuck with trouble too, but that, see, shit like that, that hurt, bro. Like, I know, I know. damn, bro, you killed the nigga over. Your girl was going to fuck the nigga regardless, regardless bro. Regardless. You go to jail, she going to fuck him. You die. You, even if you, like, okay. If you, she's still gonna fuck him, bro. It's nothing you can do. Nothing you can that's, do. You, it's nothing. If, if you that's gonna be with your girl, you turn around. She's she waking fuck, at this nigga. You know what nigga. I'm saying? It's nothing you can do about it. Then just get the fuck away from him. And you gonna kill the nigga all over that shit, bro. Soon as you kill that nigga, you go to jail. She gonna soon you go to jail. What you think she gonna do when you in jail? Damn. She gonna fuck another nigga. You try calling her. She answer the phone. She fucking a nigga. What you gonna do? Man. Kill a nigga on the phone. It's like you killed the nigga over a bitch and you ain't never gonna see this bitch again. What's the point? Ain't what no the point. fuck is the point, bro? Ain't no point. Man, this street shit crazy, man. Street niggas out wising up, man. Y'all need some classes. <laughs> Y'all need some lessons. Man. Hey, speaking of just street rules, just to add this on. Man, I feel like, you know, like when I said like niggas go to jail and they start realizing like the truth, it's because niggas, when niggas get caught up, the so-called streets don't take care of niggas. Like, they don't give a fuck about you. It really should be like this. This is what I think it should be for niggas to stay loyal. A nigga get caught up for a crime. Y'all all in the same gang. All right, we're going we gonna to put money together for yeah, his yeah, lawyer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Put money exactly. together for his exactly. books. Exactly. Show me that you for me. Yeah, and you yeah. Trying Show to do me shit. that we're you really a gang. Exactly. You know exactly. Team. 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 Family. Team. Team. What, family. You know, family. Whatever y'all want family. to call it now. Record label. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it's like niggas yeah. don't show the support. Niggas. And niggas, niggas be like, you know what, bro? Fuck these niggas. Yeah, nigga. Mom be having fish fries just to get this nigga right in jail. And it's like, niggas don't even come to the fish fry, bro. <laughs> nigga come to the fish fry and be like, come on, man. You know me. I You gonna charge me for that fish? Yeah. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Crazy. He be like, like, oh, come on, come on auntie, like, you gonna charge me for the fish? This nigga, y'all like charge me for the fish? Do I should I trust this nigga? <laughs> like, this is the nigga that we were supposed to be working together. Yeah, man. And this nigga gonna charge me? Like, man, like, this shit crazy, bro. I got blood on my motherfucking hands, bro. Niggas don't sell nothing to help the nigga out, man. Do a, a man, do a, a hood a sale, man. A goddamn garage sale for this nigga just so y'all can help him with his lawyer, man. Do but some, show it's, some, it's, show it's some. Effort. It's effort, effort, respect. God damn, man, it comes a long way. But y'all don't do nothing for these niggas, and y'all wonder why these niggas tell, cause they be in there by themselves, hurt. <laughs> like, Crazy. Damn, man, niggas yeah, all man. for themselves, bro. Yeah, man. Fuck the streets, though, man. R.I.P. the Dolphin. Fuck C.M.F. So, this just came across my mind. I just want to, you know, pick y'all brains with this. So, my question to y'all is, if you seen a man beating on a woman, Sheesh. and basically, you have the choice to help her out or mind your damn business, what are y'all doing? Do you get involved in other people's relationship problems and squabbles? Is what I'm asking. That's a huge relationship problem, though, man. So I said squabbles as well. <laughs> that's that's kind of hard, bro, because you don't want to get involved in motherfucking situation. But also, you never want to see shit like that happen. Because that's really fucked up, bro. So it's like, what the fuck do you do? Because, you know, sometimes them motherfuckers get in disputes... And then she go right back to the nigga and shit. Nigga. Can I tell you about experience? Oh, shit. <laughs> so you done seen that shit. Can I tell you about experience? Yeah. I ain't gonna tell motherfuckers where I was, you know. Damn. But I just see a nigga hitting a, hitting a you know, hitting a jump. Mm. Ming. 
just, you know, smacking her. Man, Damn. bro was like, somebody tried to be Superman and was like, man, you know what I'm saying? Stop, yeah. stop hitting the lady, young man, you know what I'm saying? Stop hitting the lady, this, that, and the third. Nigga was like, no, don't, you know what I'm saying? Get your hands off me type shit. Yeah. Man, nigga elbowed the nigga. Nah, these niggas end up fighting outside. Damn. The bitch end up looking stupid. And guess where this dumbass bitch come, goes walking right after everybody stops fighting. She walked straight to that nigga. <laughs> Went straight to the nigga's car. <laughs> Went straight to the nigga's car, bro. The nigga that got no fight, bro. Damn, I just did all this shit. That shit was point blank proof to me to bro. stay out of motherfuckers' business, bro. Because yeah, they are going to go right fucking back. Bro. Literally. That, Literally, and I don't be understand. I'll be like, what? it's nothing for us to understand. It's nothing for us what to understand. Be, it's Sometimes like, they say it's love. They, they, they seem it shows them that they love. Love, <laughs> bruh. Black eyes, busted lips, wait, bloody wait, nose. Wait. I, like, I've heard that before. Handprints. You know I mean? I've heard that before, but <laughs> I never. I, it, it can't be true, right? Shit. Then that's how motherfuckers actually think. That's how. Like, if you beat me, you love me. It be the bitches that be having mm, fucked up uh, parents, you know, fucked up history backgrounds, and they don't really know what true love is or like Damn. how love is supposed to be treated. So they just stick into what they think they know, and mm. yeah, they get it. Yeah. Now nah, you right, cause some. Females, when you try to be nice to them, they don't like that shit. Bruh. They really, like, get in their bag, like, why the fuck, why you want to do this for me? Like, I've, I've said, like, <laughs> I've done nice shit to females or said nice shit to females. They'd be yeah. like, why are you so nice? I'd be like, wait, Roll up I the thought, sleeves for this one. <laughs> I thought that's what you're supposed to do, like. Man? You don't want a gentleman bit? <laughs> like, shit. Nah, for real. They'd be like, man, you too nice. Like, I'd be like, Okay, all right, like I guess. You like, you open the door for the bitch, and she slammed that shit. Like, man, nigga, I can open hey, my own shit. Hey, man, I didn't expect... Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Try to open the door for me. I got this. Like, okay, okay, all right, all right. Like, I'm just trying, you know, be nice to you. Like, that's all That I mean. shit, wow. That man. shit is wow. You know, at the end of the day, you, you got to just shoot my shit. You got me thinking, like, yeah, man. that's probably true, bro. Man, you got to choose your battles. You I'd be like, damn. Choose wisely, man. What choose was your it. dad doing to your mom then? <laughs> Woo. What was your uncle doing to your aunt then, man? Sheesh. Grandmother, grandfather. Trauma. All fucked up. Yeah, all fucked up. All fucked up from the beginning of the apple tree. God damn. But yeah, but nah, it's, that's what I feel like. You know, speaking just, of, yeah, yeah, nah, go ahead. I don't say I could just like Cam Newton was like, I can't do that. I can't do that. Oh, like you know, um, you know, I, well, I like st step yeah, in. Yeah, I, I had to step in. I have to step in. Oh, uh, okay. Charles the White said, "I'm out of my motherfucking business." <laughs> Fuck. Nah, Charles the White is a crazy nigga. He's but he be telling the truth. That, yeah, he be telling the yeah. truth at the same time. Yeah. That's the crazy shit. Yeah. He be telling the truth at the same yeah. time. But yeah, you was about to say, speaking of relationship. Yeah, yeah. Speaking of relationship, man. What the fuck going on? Uh -oh. I don't know if this shit is real or fake. What the fuck going on with Cardi B Offset, man? Oh, uh, I knew you was going to say that. How did I know you was going to right. say that? The, hold on, hold on. I got, I got to pull up the tweet, man. I got to pull up the tweet. <laughs> That nigga said some shit about... Nah, that what she said. That, uh, uh, all right, so of course she was like... He accused her of fucking... While, she was, while, she, while was she was pregnant. pregnant. With, his, with, his, with his baby, right? And she said... I did. Yeah. She said she admitted she, that she, she did. She said and did. And did. To the exact quote. Yeah, and, yeah, and did. And did. All you know, exclamation marks. You know, you know the lingo the, the females be using out here. And did you oh know okay yeah, 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 yeah. yeah okay 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 but the wild part is when I saw her tweet this is exact I'm gonna read her exact shit you cheated on me years after years my nigga the only difference is you got caught I didn't you wouldn't be you would be but more but her if you knew the relationship me and takeoff had before he passed oh. Oh, I repeat to the only real nigga from the group. I miss those nights. Oh, oh, shit. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, 
this 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 shit did a whole. That's why I'm like, this, bro. Cause the nigga just tried to big up and was like, man, I know my brother take off and my bros was right about this whole whole time. They tried to bro. tell me, and it, and she said, oh yeah, nigga, you, <laughs> oh yeah. That's why I'm like, bro. All right. When she said that, I'm like, is this shit real, bro? Is this shit real? Or is this... Because, you know, they broken up, like... Hey, it's like their third time doing this hey, shit. Hey, I was just about to go into the, <laughs> him uh, talking about her fucking while he, she was pregnant. No, And this bro. just did a whole nother conversation. No, bro, this, she tweeted this shit. That shit can't get no more disrespectful, number one. You pregnant with another nigga, baby, and you letting other niggas fuck. Yeah. That's already disrespectful. It don't get yeah. no more disrespectful than that. She just... That's why I'm like, bruh, is this shit real? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. really saying you like we fuck the niggas dead homie. Dead homie, bruh. Talking dead about Dead family member. And it's not, it's not single. It's plural. She said she missed those nights. With an S. I'm like, bruh, what was going on, bruh? <laughs> and it's like... <laughs> I mean, it, it could be before they was, you know, together type shit. And it was like when they was getting together. Or if it was like when they was early phases and nigga still no, makes it worse. Nigga, no. I know. I and know. You, know you know it wasn't, bruh. Because the early phases, I don't even think Cardi B was known. Or she was she on. Was, she was known. She was known. She was known. Early stages of Migos? No, I'm talking about early stages of her and Offset. If yeah. that's what we talking about. Nah, that's crazy to... It is. To fuck a... Uh, man, that's shit, homie. Oh, man. In the early stages that, of y'all... That, right. that don't need... That I'm, I'm gonna get my sense. shit together. Females don't need... Females don't do together. that. I mean, most females don't mm. do that. But I'm just like, bruh. This shit reporting live news right now, bruh. Nah, I feel like she's just saying that just to get mm. the nigga mad. Because you know that's what women do, man. That's just... They do shit just to get you mad. Just, yeah, that's why I fucked that nigga, blah, 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 yeah. type shit. It yeah. might could be one of those. It has, it to, be, has to be. I don't one believe of those. that shit, bro. Because ain't no way she fucked that nigga. <laughs> ain't no way she fucked Tango, bro. Tango was buried. And she picked him because he's dead. That's like, what I'm saying, bro. She could have said Quavo. That's she what I'm saying, said, bro. You know, yeah. He, I, like he can't be out here to say no. Nah, that's cap. I just think it's so fucked up because he just said my brother. Take off, and my other bros told me about your ass. I should have listened. And that's what I'm thinking. That was her replied. response. That yeah, was yeah. definitely her response. Yeah. You're talking about he's saying this nigga. I fuck take off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's what why. You, I'm, that's what I'm saying. It gotta be cap. It gotta be cap. Cause ain't no way, bro. It, bro, it gotta be. He, the nigga's not here to prove that shit. I know. I know. So she just throwing it out there because you. She. I know. The nigga can't prove it. He all said all fucked up right now. He's like, if at first I said he was cornered, you know what I'm saying, when you're on the, under, on the ropes and you're cornered and you can't get out and you just like this right now, and mm -hmm. now that motherfucker, he I, he trying to get up, they, you know what I'm they saying? They doing a countdown. Yeah, they, they count right now. He, <laughs> they count right now. He's trying to get up off that shit. Like, because right. when you hear that, like, I, if we surprised, I know this nigga is like, that's why, nah, that's why I'm like, bro, he got to be looking at it like Because he already said, I'm going to fuck you. He, he told her, I'm going to fuck your ops. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. Since she Wait, fuck. That, that's what she said? Or yeah, that's, that's what, what he said. said. Uh, and she was just like, nigga, you lame. This, that, and that. I would never fuck your ops out because that's, that's, that's dangerous. Yeah, like, she would rather fuck the family. <laughs> she not, she'll not fuck the ops. She won't fuck the family, man. Keep it in the family. Why yeah, not? Yeah, man. Wow. But wow. I mean, it's like, bro, that's what I'm saying. This is like they third time doing this shit, bro. And they're going to get back together. And that reminds you, or did we get involved in people's relationship problems and squabbles? And she about to drop a song about the nigga. So it's like, I'm like, bro. Everybody's trying to get the world back on the side. Since everybody keeps saying she's she just about, yeah, man. always with Offset, always going back. Bitch, you didn't have a baby bomb again. Man. What else can you say that we don't believe that you know? Maybe that's some of the toxic relationships we talking about, man. This this how they show they love each other, man. They just they like the intense shit, and then they get back, and then the sex is even better after that. <laughs> that shit do be crazy. I ain't when they get to miss with each yeah, other, yeah, like that, that miss you sex be crazy. Yeah, man. That, I'm mi that you, miss you sex be crazy. That's probably how they had a baby. <laughs> Real shit. Real shit. Nah, I'll tell you, like... And then you look at Offset's face when they when, when a newborn, like, in the hospital, the nigga was like... 
You could like you can tell there's some tension going on in there though. Oh, I thought maybe that's when I she told she him like he was nah. He was sad and shit. Yeah, like the nigga like you know what I'm saying like I, like. I, I, have I, you seen the I picture? Ain't, I ain't gonna judge a nigga by a picture, man. I'm just saying I, like, I ain't gonna judge a nigga by a picture because motherfuckers be saying that shit like oh. It could just be at the yeah, it could just be a moment, yeah, moment type yeah, shit. Like so the doctor go, came in where the like yeah, the baby yeah, would just went to sleep, yeah, and now the baby done woke up. Yeah, now he got to put her back to sleep. It could be yeah, anything. Yeah, anything. It could be anything. Yeah, he, you yeah. know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna just see a patient and be like, oh, he. That's the part of like, the whole about, story together. That's where Cardi B. This is the part where Cardi B says she fucked another nigga. Why wow, she was yeah. pregnant, <laughs> you know and then they got like, the whole baby in his yeah. hand. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you just said that to me like, just now. How y'all just gonna put all that together off one picture? Like, I can't, I can't do that. Nah, you can't. So, yeah. So I, I don't know, man. All I know is if I see them back together, that'll be crazy. <laughs> but I, just, I would completely like, understand. Like, the like sex must be good. <laughs> the sex must be. Bro, he said that she admitted. Like y'all jumping off with the top of the bed. The nigga other. can get home at six, seven in the morning. She be dead ass sleep. All he does pull out, put it in her mouth, and she ready. She did say. Uh, I was like, man. She said, uh, <laughs> I was like, on the on the song, she was like, uh, I like to suck this dick when it's soft, when it's gummy. Yeah. I'm like, God damn, this bitch is a freak. Like, like on this waking shit, up at six in the mo seven in the morning, man, ready. Some bitches like that though, bro. I some know, bitches. I know. That's what some I'm bitches. Saying. Yeah, and it's like that. Nigga. It's like you be thinking like, oh, it's late night. She, you know, saying she I'm was, gonna let her sleep. She be I'm like, saying. why didn't you call me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some bitches be like shit. that, bro. It's like, and you know, at the end of the day, you know what they say: every nigga get tired of a bad bitch. Man, ain't every you know nigga tired of any. Yeah, bitch, it's, right. saying, it's always you know annoying. A, a bad bitch, bitch is right. always annoying to some nigga. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So it might be at a time I, I where you know it's like you know I, what I, I, I didn't put that out there. What? That every nigga is tired of every. <laughs> I said it's at least one nigga that's tired of one. Yeah, it's, it's at least one nigga, and it might not be me. <laughs> and I love all my bitches. <laughs> I love all, all my bitch. I don't hey, have bitches. There you go. Hey, there you go. There you go, yeah, man. No. There you go, man. There you These go. These niggas man. that be having multiple bitches, I don't be like, why do you have multiple bitches? <laughs> I don't understand you. One is not enough. Gosh. I know you gotta be in a twenty verse one and shit like that. Yeah, you know man. I, mean? I just need one. Just one. One versus one. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I need. <laughs> hey, man, salute my guy, man. Salute. Yeah, you know, you know me. Come on, man, you know me. That's a real man. nigga right there, yeah. man. Yeah, man. Real gentleman, brother. One versus one. That's all you need. You know what I'm saying? So you, had, you, you had a knuckle up there, brother. <laughs> I, it, it was lips. <laughs> nah, yeah. sometimes my arm be fucked up. <laughs> you had a knuckle up there, brother. I'm trying to count how many. Come on, man. Nigga said. Nigga, nigga said <laughs> nigga said Hey stop playing bro For all Nah man Good shit yeah, man. man Good shit I'm happy for you bro You know what I'm saying yeah. What all, all people should be like that Oh you know okay I, mean? I thought you lot... <laughs> Yo stop playing <laughs> What <man? laughs> Alright Alright but Yeah man Nah but How y'all yeah, feel yeah, about yeah, that yeah. Cardi being off saying shit You know <laughs> Put in the comments Shit, mention this on Instagram, DJ320 underscore. Please don't forget the underscore. WAP TV. And if you want some clothes, you know how to do shop a WAP on Man, you. Man, why you say that like we about to end the show? I'm not about to end the show. I'm just typing. <laughs> oh, I'm, you God know what I'm saying? Damn. Tapping in for them so they, they want to tap in. Yeah, I'm going to say this for the last part of that. If they do get to back uh, back together, that's real love. That's real love. That's like the, like you said, the, the grandfather beating the... Grandma, but she always come back. That's real love. Black real love. Black love, man. Real black love. Is that black love? She uh. She's Spanish, but she she she. She a hoe. She what? She a hoe. Oh. She is a hoe. Who? Cardi B. She's a hoe. Bruh, you you sit gonna sit here and tell me Cardi B not a hoe? I mean, every hoe not a bad, stupid, 
Dumb yeah, 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 exactly. I'm just saying, exactly. she's she a hoe. A smart hoe. She a smart hoe. A smart business She's intelligent. Hoe. Yeah, she's yeah. very, she she's got very money. intelligent. Yeah, she yeah. knows how to manage her money. Mm -hmm. But she's a hoe. She got hoe tendencies, like. Yeah. Uh, man, <laughs> so, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She ready. And he, he just said six in the morning, call me. Put that shit in my mouth. I'll wake up. Shit. Man, she's a hoe. But not every host do it. You know, I fuck with hoes too. It looks like a duck. Quacks like a duck. You know what I'm saying? Raps like a duck. Charleston White said, to go back to Charleston, he said the best women are hoes. He did. Honestly, bro. I mean. I don't even, I hate to, because I don't know who's watching, but. Bro, I, 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 <laughs> I ain't even have to say nothing. <laughs> Bruh, I was fucking with this one joint. She was a hoe, bruh. I fucked with her for two whole years, nigga. That bitch is solid, nigga. I swear I could call that bitch up right now, bruh. That bitch is solid, bruh. I ain't gonna cap. Damn. Yeah, bruh. Two years later, still. Nigga, I probably known her for two, three, man. I'm saying we was fucking with each other for two years. But after that, nigga, she's still solid, nigga. Oh, damn. Yeah, bruh. I'm bro, I'm telling you, bro. Yeah, it'd be, it be like that. It'd be like that. I think she you know she been around so many niggas, she started picking up on nigga mentality. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That too. <laughs> that shit too. You know but you know what? Nah, I'm good. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, nah, I'm good. Let's yeah. just she, fuck. You she, know? Yeah, she, she know what niggas like, what niggas gonna think. So she not, she not and, gonna play herself. Man, if you listen to Glorilla, man, she giving these bitches the blueprint. Man. Lord have mercy. Man. Lord have mercy. Give it's it like, bro. Like, if you want to keep your nigga, you know, in check, you, 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 you got to do your thing. You got to do your thing. Damn. You going to keep him. She says you ain't going to think about his roster when he, you know. I was like, shit. Nah, these bitches still want to be, uh, motherfucking. They still want to be in a house with one nigga, though. But it's just like, they... Feel like they have to be a hoe just because they don't want to get treated bad. And sexy red says so. Yeah, they they really want to be with one nigga, cooking, That's... rubbing the nigga feet, all that shit. But it's just like they feel like they have to be hoes just because they feel like they can't trust niggas. That's right. what it is. Yeah, yeah. That's really what it is. And man. it makes sense. It's just like nigga t nigga mentality. That's yeah, all. Man. Just like for us, like you yeah. know why we. Would if we did if we, you, if we did if we did you know multiple women it's because of the fact we don't trust because nah, of the fact I feel like if men just be horny bro honestly that thing I don't think it's about trust or nothing I think men just be horny I just think it's the male thing to do it's like bro you know you see niggas just be horny bro I don't think it has nothing to do with you loving or you trusting I just think niggas just be horny that's it. I'm gonna say because you go, you gonna fuck a bitch and not give a fuck about her, right? And you know what I'm right, saying, right? right not right, saying you right. did it, but <laughs> you know what I'm saying. <laughs> but you know what I'm saying. But if a woman fucks another nigga, they she have, willing to do shit for that nigga, right? 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 Like, yeah. And the nigga like, could be like, type yeah, shit. the nigga yeah. be like, I don't want to be in a relationship. She still gonna do relationship type shit. That's just what it is, bro. That is very true. Yeah, man. So. I just think males, males just be horny, females are emotional. That's just all it is. Well, I'm going to say this. Back in my younger days, and you know, when I would, you know what I'm saying? Last week? We'd do the switcheroo <laughs> thing. I said young. I wasn't young last week, my nigga. Like, come on now. But like I was saying, it was just because of the fact that <coughs> the ex that I would be with, previous relationship, well, you know, <laughs> do a nigga wrong, hurt a nigga, so... Niggas do what the you know what they know, mm. you know what I'm saying. Mm. So that's that's. What I got mean. a question since we talking about relationships. Do you honestly truly believe in love? And part two to that question: Do you want to get married? Eventually, but um. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's possible, but it ain't short. It's not a short span. It take love take time. Okay. And I I'm not talking about two three years like, cause it's like, 
the more you be with a person, the more you learn this person, the more you learn like what you don't like about them, what you do like about them. And it's just like up to you to weigh in the, the likes and the dislikes. And is this is somebody who I want to be with like forever yeah. to the point where I'm going to put the ring on her finger. So when y'all meet each other in three months, y'all just having the best sex and y'all like each other the most and y'all miss each other every day. That's not love. That's just... That's, that's lust. Just, okay. That's lust. Okay. That's lust. Okay. And horny shit. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? For yeah, sure. that's less than horny shit. For sure. You know. It's, it, 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 it's little shit that, you know what I'm saying, that just be throwing out the love signals. Mm. You know what I mean? You, you think you in love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You it be, think, it, yeah. It's, it's, that's right. It's lust. Yeah. That's what it's the, It's lust. Is, it's a very, like, you know the diagram when you got the, the light. The, the similar and the other light yeah, type shit. Yeah. Love and lust is right there in the middle, brother. Right next to each right other. Right next to each other. Yeah. Right yeah, next yeah, to each yeah, other. Yeah, it's yeah. literally love and lust. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mm. So that's how I feel about it. Mm. So vice versa when it comes to you. Do you believe in love and do you see yourself getting married eventually? I'm going to answer the marriage dream first. It's not that... It can't happen, but I don't want to get married. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's how I feel okay. as of right now. Yeah, it might change, right you know. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to get married because right now, I just feel like, man, motherfuckers don't stay committed to each other in marriage. Motherfuckers. It's like, it's something like marriage is like a baby. Literally, literally a little bit. When it comes to like the relationship before the baby comes or before the marriage, mm -hmm. everything is good. Soon as the marriage come in, you live together, you move in together, you gotta see this person for the rest of your Man, life and, every day. And it's and like, like and nowadays motherfuckers So it's, it's too it's too easy to get a divorce that motherfuckers is just like ready to do that shit because it's just like Man, once y'all get in one argument, that's it. She might get, be like, "Man, fuck, fuck you, nigga." Yeah, I want a divorce. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's just like you always on it. It's like walking on eggshells. Yeah, it's you like you don't know what's gonna happen. It's like that's why you gotta yeah. have a good marriage. Like not just because you got my baby or just yeah. you know I think I'm in love. Yeah. I want to know I'm in love. Yeah. You know what I mean? It come to the point where, like, I'm proposed to you. I you know I dropped the bomb and then. We about to get married, and then all of a sudden, we ain't even get married yet, and you already acting funny. Right, because it's like... Now, I'm about to be fucked up for a minute because of the fact that I'm thinking I was going to marry you. Because it's like, bruh, some people, it's like they argue with their girl a lot, but then they it's like, oh, I've been with her for years, so I should marry her. Mm -hmm. but it's like, bruh, y'all argue all the time. What you think is going to happen <laughs> once y'all get married and... See, and then y'all keep doing them arguments. She gonna be like, I don't want to be with this nigga no more. Exactly. Because now exactly. she can actually divorce you versus back then. It's like she could step away. For yeah, 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 yeah. Mar That's that, another thing yeah. about marriage, too, because it's, it's so much time. And like, first, the, the wedding, that, that shit just be crazy. Bruh. The shit that you got to spend for weddings is ridiculous. No, I fuckers get to arguing a lot during the uh, wedding times. Cause it's like, bro, it'd be big disagreements, and bro, they get nigga the had a, Nigga had a bachelor party last night and shit, and your boy drunk as shit talking about, hey, boy, he throwing that, she throwing that shit back like that stripper did on you last night, boy. You be like, yo, nigga, what the fuck is you talking about? <laughs> I was in the bathroom. That's why I was in the bathroom. I ain't know what the fuck he talking about, but I don't know what he talking about. <laughs> So like, oh, so you you ain't fucked that stripper last night? Damn, just and fucking up the whole marriage, man. man. Whole, taking the towel off, all of a sudden, hey, bro, you gotta see me now. <laughs> now you gotta throw the whole shit off. Man, now it's a fight at the wedding. Damn, not at the wedding though. God damn. You man. just said it'd be arguments and disagreements, and you know it do, bro. It do like when they planning that shit. Sad and... bitches coming to the wedding and shit like that. Oh no, nah, that's crazy. That's crazy. If you got your... How'd she get in? <laughs> How the fuck... Who invited you? <laughs> How the fuck you get there? How the fuck did you get the Addy? Yeah. How the fuck did you How get... How the fuck you here? What the fuck is you doing here? That will fuck up a nigga whole shit while nah, he getting married. A nigga like... 
Like, like I'm talking about during the part where he put a ring on the finger, nigga, kissed the bride, nigga, checking the side eye. nigga the, the pastor's reading in the Bible, which you about to lie to your wife that you literally, and the side bitch sitting right there. Nah, bro. Like, you, motherfuckers can't have the side bitch at the wedding now. Come on, man. The boys gotta be like, hey, hey bro, you, 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 you gotta go. You, you, you gotta go. Like, you, you, you man, gotta carry go. Carry that bitch out, bro. Real talk, carry that bitch out. <laughs> God damn, Ain't man. Ain't no way nigga gonna be comfortable at his wedding with, his, with the side bitch there. Hell no. Nah. All of a sudden, you in tears, the, the bride coming, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Her husband, you know, tearing up and shit like that. With happy tears. All of a sudden, you see the side bitch come walking late, and you like, nah, bruh. Nah, bruh. Nah, oh, bruh. You gonna be like, <laughs> Am I about to marry her, or am I about to keep my side, <laughs> bitch? That's a hard decision. <laughs> bruh. Side bitch saying a little slick shit out of her mouth during the wedding. Nah, bruh. Everybody That's what I'm saying. That's why motherfuckers be getting married in Mexico and shit. They know the side bitch can't book that flight. <laughs> Get married in Cabo. <laughs> Ain't no way she coming here. <laughs> Obviously, you see that bitch with her luggage. She ain't even make it to the room yet. She come in with luggage. You know that oh, bitch shit. crazy. Like, how the fuck did you know I was in Mexico? How the fuck did you know where to go in Mexico? If niggas got side bitches right before they get married to you, that's crazy. It is. Yeah, that's crazy. It is. It is. So, yeah. Yeah, so. You, you reap what you sow, motherfucker. Yeah. You know what I mean? The real lesson is don't get married. <laughs> it's like that. Don't get married unless you're ready, ready. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. You're a thousand percent ready. Not a hundred percent. Not two hundred percent. Not five hundred percent. Not eight hundred percent. A thousand? A thousand percent. The full stack. Okay. Not eight hundred of the stack. A whole stack. Okay. That's how we going to go. We got to talk about sports before we get out of here now. Do we? Gotta talk Do about we? sports. Player of the week, nigga. I want to talk about sports. Player of the week. What's his name? Jaden Daniels, nigga. That's his name. Jaden Daniels, nigga. Where is he from? It's like, now, what's good? I don't know where that nigga from. Isn't he from, like, Mississippi or something like that? I don't know where he's from, uh, but he I, I went to Louisiana State. LSU. He's he a southern boy. With my cousin, though. Shout out to Nicole. Yeah, so, you know, you don't know who he Yeah, 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 yeah. They was dating? Nah, nigga. You always got to go there with the I'm just saying, you said with my, with my cousin, I, I though. I said, nigga. With my cousin, though. I'm saying, nigga, it's close. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. But, um. Close relationship? No, motherfucker. It's just a friend. Friend. Okay. Yeah. Not to say shit, he a cool dude, all jokes to the side in real mm, life and shit like that. He cool. Yeah. He ain't like an asshole or nothing like that. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. But yeah, man, he done did that shit. I don't remember the last time we had a quarterback that gave us 40 fucking points. Bruh. First of all. I don't, I, I, don't, I don't remember the last time we... I think it. the Bengals been done, so... Oh, uh, now it's the Bengals. First, first, oh, Bengals now, been done, so now was, it's the Bengals. Nah, shit. that was an easy one for y'all. Nah, it's the easy uh, one. Come now, on. them, Joe, niggas Joe the, them niggas almost beat the them niggas almost beat the Chiefs. They almost beat the Chiefs, but they almost done. Nigga got the blonde hair. You know when you dye your hair blonde, shit go bad, man. You start looking like a goofy and shit, man. You know. Damn, what? so all goofies got blonde hair. I'm trying to shit on nobody. Yeah, you know when you dye your hair, you know what I'm saying. That change in your life. Yeah, it change. That change because it life. make you look like uh, what the white people will be saying, douchebag. Oh, yeah. <laughs> a douche, a whole douche, a whole douchebag. Wow. <laughs> but uh, yeah, man. All right, so sports, NFC East. Yeah, that's, yeah. Specifically. Yeah, yeah. You because you said something about the NFC East. What what, what you got to get off your chest? Man, I mean, I'm gonna start with my team, Philadelphia Eagles. We just even though we 2 one one we looking very lame. <laughs> like, bruh. Very lame. Like, this nigga Jalen Hurts throwing you, picks, fumbling. It's like... Are we going to say this on camera? Is, say it. Is Jalen Hurts overrated? I don't think he had that big of a rating to be overrated. 
Like, who put him up there like that? I mean, he went to the Super Bowl. He did. Last season, we started off, what, like 11-1? and one? So how could you be overrated if you did all that? Hey, brother, I just asked a question. Now I'm saying, like, who put him up there, like, top five? Like, nobody ever did that. Okay. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just asking he, a question. Now, he's a good quarterback. He just needs to be consistent. Right. I yeah. like that word. Yeah. yeah consistent a, for sure. Because yeah, it should be all over the place. Come on, man. If a nigga took you to the Super Bowl, that means he could make it all the way to the end. All right. If a nigga go 11-1, he could do, he could win. So... He just needs to be consistent. I'm tired of the fumbling, the interceptions, and you know what I'm saying? It's just like, I'm not liking that shit. And defense got a part to Y'all take won the blame, though. though. Y'all won, though. It's not about that, That was bro. a sloppy-ass win, wasn't it? Because you see, like, oh, if we go against them niggas, we going to lose. Even though we won this one, if we go against them other niggas, we going to lose. That's why it be, like, a little scary. And we should have beat Atlanta, too. But that was on defense. That's what I'm saying. Defense got to take a little bit of this shit, too. We ain't got no fucking defense. Yeah. We ain't got no defense. I ain't going to tell everybody the hot ticket bet. You know what I'm saying? But what sh- sh- should I give him to him? Should I give him the hot ticket bet? Man, what the fuck? What, you going to become a millionaire? No, no, no. I'm talking about for the Redskins. Oh, who, like, yeah, give it to him. All right, bro. Any wide receiver that's number one, whenever they play the Redskins, make sure you get the motherfucker for the over yards. And I guarantee you, you, you will win every damn. goddamn time. Y'all corn is that bad? Bro, Marvin Harrison Jr., nigga, do you realize what he's about to do to, to that? I didn't even say to us, that one nigga, <laughs> that one nigga that we have. Yeah, I remember that one nigga when we was watching the game. <laughs> That nigga, he couldn't. What's the? Uh, I he forgot could. his name. I don't know. I, I don't the know. from uh, from the Giants, but oh, Nables. Yeah, Nables. Malik Nables. Nables. Yeah, yeah. He was running all over that nigga. Same but y'all, see, route every time. See, y'all still won, and is, does that really count? <laughs> like that's what I be saying. When we went like that, I just be like, all right, bro. Vin like, Diesel. Like winning's yeah, we, winning. Yeah, we won, but you it's can like, win what? by an inch or a mile. Winning is winning. I don't know, man. Y'all won. A terrible game. When y'all was getting run over. Who? Y'all was getting run over and y'all won by field goals. Who? <laughs> Red, my bad. Not Redskins. Commanders. <laughs> Nigga, y'all kicked all field goals. Y'all was getting... Neighbor, is it Neighbors or Nables? Nables. Nables. I, I can't wanna... forget that name. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Nables again. 30 <laughs> yards. That's what I'm saying. He was running all over y'all. <laughs> there he goes again. He not even running like, back, but it just. How could you even be happy in that situation? Cause you, you, I that shit like that made me see the future. I'm like, there ain't no future in that shit. I'm like, bro. Nah, but that nigga. Nah, I, 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 I see what you're saying, but this past Monday, prime time, cause everybody was watching us. They damn sure wasn't watching the. Uh, <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, the uh, Jaguars and the, the ja- Bills. The ja- they definitely that was wasn't watching game. the Jaguars. That was a terrible game. <laughs> yeah, it's fake. Yeah. So we had a good game, actually. Yeah, it was a. And the fact that I liked about that game, we always had control. We didn't mm-hmm. have to go back or try to get. You know what I'm saying? Get up. We was always ahead of the game. And every time they scored a touchdown, that boy JD. <clears throat> Stop lying! No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't doing none of that. Stop lying, bruh. It was a terrible game, bruh. It was really a bad game. Like, what was you seeing on your half? He was not doing, he was not doing no room, no in, no. He was not doing none of that, bruh. He was just making okay passes. Okay passes? <laughs> Running the whole time, getting hit. Like, bruh, he was not doing no superstar shit where you put confidence in you, bro. Really? No, he wasn't, bro. Really? Like, he was running damn near every play. And when you see your quarterback running every play, that should not give you confidence. Because it's like, of course you're going to gain some. But you get hit a lot, bro. You know, it's 17 games. You think he about to run every game like that? Did you see the records that he broke? On Monday, Bruh, I'm talking about longevity. You talking about now? I understand that, but you know, man, this thing, you treating this shit like playoffs is right around the corner, right? 
This shit gotta last, bruh. I understand. I understand. You think he could do that the whole season? I think so. When it gets colder, getting hit like that in the cold? Nigga better bundle up. <laughs> bruh, it's gonna be cold as shit. You get hit, that shit gonna sting the shit out you, bruh. It is, though. That, that cold. <laughs> That's that, what that, I'm that, saying. That, 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 that. Do we play anybody in the cold this year? Nigga, y'all shit is. Y'all don't have a dome? What the fuck? We don't. It'll be cold as shit in that motherfucker. <laughs> y'all better not play the Bills or like any of them cold ass states. Y'all gonna be mad as shit. I know. I know. <laughs> y'all gonna be mad as shit. I know. Shit. I know. But, um, man, to answer your question, I, I I think, you know what I'm saying, we got potential. Last game, for sure, showed me that him and Terry, they got some shit going on to the point where they 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 uh they finally, I guess they're seeing eye to eye to the point where Terry can get open and J Daniels is not going to miss him. Yeah, I salute Terry, though. I yeah, that, that was a hell of a catch. Yeah, he, hell of a yeah, catch. He's a good player. I hell salute him, but I'm just like, the others... I don't know. They gotta they gotta build up for me to be like, all right. Nah, that's, for that's sure. A solid player. For sure. It's only, yeah. it's only Terry. He's solid. Yeah, yeah, yeah for he's sure. Solid. For sure. Scary Terry. Yeah, Scary man. Terry, man. Shout out and salute. So I have to say, how do you feel just about you know the season so far? Like you would think this team was gonna be good. You thought this team was gonna be bad, and you know what? Did, like how like how do you see the NFL going right now? Uh, I think it's pretty the same. In my eyes, Chiefs to the Super Bowl again. It's what it's looking like. I know. That's what it's looking like. I That's know. what I'm saying. It looks like the same shit. Like even the first game, I was like, "Damn, it's looking like them niggas gonna go back." Like the Ravens should be up right now. I mean, I feel like you know, last game. But they won their game. They won their game. They won their game. That shit was a sloppy game too. You know that. I mean, they started off heavy, and then... I mean, I'm going to say it's sloppy because, yeah, I'm yeah, being they, biased they, now because of Dallas. So, they yeah. started off good, and then it's like, they let them boys come back. And they then, did. Let them get an onside kick and all that shit. Yeah, that's the Crazy. only thing. It's like, he got to be more consistent, too. That's what I'm saying. Niggas ain't showing the, the, the consistency yet. I'm not seeing anybody except for, like, the Chiefs show that, oh, yeah, we got we solidified now. The Seahawks are undefeated. But I don't know if they Gino, you don't fuck with Gino? I always feel like Gino not uh but it's like, you know, they can say he like that, but you know. Pop another bottle if you like that. But and the Cowboys. What you think about the Cowboys, man? I can't talk on the Cowboys. I'm a Redskins fan, so I'm gonna sound biased as shit. I ain't gonna say nothing about it. What they Dang. four and one? They are three and one, three and one, cause they played yesterday. Yeah, them niggas one. only lost to the Saints. Yeah, they only lost and to the Saints. Got they got beat bad. That shit dog by they the Saints. Bad. It was so bad. See, so this is how. That's why I say I'm a Redskins fan. I can't speak because you was at the game, and you see the game that we was having when we was facing the Giants. As soon as they showed the Cowboys score on the board. The whole motherfucking crowd just started cheering like we scored a touchdown or some shit like that, bro. I said, yo, what happened? What happened? I missed something. They showing the scores. I said. Y'all some real haters. Y'all some real haters. I was, I, I, I'm not even going, you know, to be biased. It's because y'all some shit. Y'all just want to hate nah, on us. Nah, we some shit. Because y'all are some shit, right? Our defense. Y'all some shit. We can't guard That's why y'all cheer for. We can't guard Y'all cheer run. for other people's, uh. You know, down for us, cause y'all some shit. <laughs> we not, we 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 getting together. We getting there. We getting there. We getting there. Right. I'm we just, gonna I'm see what happens. Longevity. The Cardinals. Longevity. We play. We all play this week. Uh, shit. I don't even. I got check. This nigga's not a fan, y'all. I got check. But Marvin Harrison, man. Junior. And I'm saying Marvin Harrison gonna be at the game. And <laughs> he gonna take y'all back to the cult days. <laughs> Nigga, he gonna, he taught us everything, so... Nah, yeah. bruh. It's gonna be like... Let me just check the schedule just to make sure. Motherfucking, who we play. Oh, we play the Bucks. That's who we lost in the playoffs. Damn. Yeah. Vengeance. 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 What y'all gonna do? We gonna do what we do. Fly. 
See, you're an Eagles fan, man. It's all right. I'm going to get you a jersey. I'm going to get you a jersey, bro. Man, let's get into this new music yes, alert. Yes, sir. sir, man. We going. We, where we going with it? We going one artist. One? That's how I'm feeling. I don't three know, out man. of three? Man, three out of three, man. 2024, fucking them up. Jesus Christ. We don't trust you. We still don't we trust you. We still don't trust you. Damn, bro. You mm -hmm. don't got no trust in your heart. And then he just said, fuck it. We ain't never going to trust you when he dropped that mixtape Pluto. Because he know niggas love that mixtape Pluto, man. Bruh. That's where, that's where he started off. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm just same thinking, damn time days. I'm, I'm just, I'm just, sing, I'm just thinking, I'm singing a song in my head right now. What's it's Tony Montana? Lil Demon. Oh, I thought you. I, was, nah, not that you was talking about back in the day. I don't fuck about that right now. We talking about <laughs> mixtape. I used to hate that song. <laughs> yeah, Tony Montana is cool. But That's motherfuckers cool. love that song. I gotta start playing shit again in the club. Shit again. Get hit down. You ain't put uh, shit. Uh, you had to take back the mixtape Pluto, man. You had to take it back to mixtape Pluto just for us. Just for us. Just because we love it so much. Man. Man. And that man. shit was. Every song. Every song. I'm it's looking at uh, the whole Apple uh, music list. That's crazy. Top. Like the whole top I, list. I, and I he just, was the first artist to do that. I listened to Lil Demon 10 times when I first heard it. Mm. I just had to get all the words right. I think he just dropped the video, if I'm not mistaken. Nah, he dropped the video. He dropped the visualizer. He oh, dropped okay. all, all, all the visualizers. Nah, he just dropped the video to one of the songs. but Brazier? Not that it was Lil Demon. Right. I don't think Let it was. Let me see the track list. Let me see the track list. Just to make sure, man. Teflon Don. Teflon Don. That's the Don. Just dropped the video. That shit. Yeah. First song. Yeah. For the startup, startup of the tape. Yo. Man, overall great project. Future great, does man. it again. Ski. Now he said it's one. Ski. He said it's one artist. But I'm kind of glad we waited to you know what I'm saying do the show today. I hope you're not about to say the name that I think you're gonna say. Now nah, go ahead, go ahead, say it, say it, say it. See him enough. Don't say that nigga, bro. You about to say that nigga? Oh my god, bro. Zan man dropped the uh, song. Oh, I think you so <laughs> He said, yeah, whoever well, we needs some perkies, whoever well, we got some perkies, some Zan, so a cup, double cup, just find me in the back. Thank y'all. <laughs> Request drugs on stage? That nigga <laughs> said, damn me. That nigga, that nigga said, damn me. Whoever got some cups, uh, some, some Xanax, some, some perks. Eh, yeah, okay. I ain't... Yeah, that's a junkie. But anyways. Man, one artist, man. One, I mean, that, that's the only artist I'm fucking with, Pluto Skit. Mixtape Pluto. Pluto Skit. Uh, I fuck with when he did that part of Pluto Skit. Uh, uh, what do you say? Yo, I, was, I think that was the vibe. I think he was just really uh, playing around shit. like that. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, I, I'm loving that because it's different. I like different shit. Like, so I was like, damn, I fucked with Future did it again. Always giving you that different shit. Different, man. Difference. And then what was the joint? Uh, I like... Uh, R.I.P. My Dogs or something. Lost My Dog. He Lost My Dogs. When niggas be like, he don't know how to do a real song, he said... Uh, 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 wait, who, wait, who, wait, who said that? Wait, no, no. Shut the fuck up. Who said he don't know how to do a real song? When has anybody ever said Future don't know how to do a real song? You gotta put it in the comments if that was you. No, if that was you, where the fuck are you at, nigga? <laughs> nigga live in Antarctica because... I ain't never met anybody say that nigga can't do no real song. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, That's man. That's what I'm saying. That nigga's complete. Like, probably the greatest artist. I could say that. Because I think it, it's true. He just... Hood niggas love him. You know what I'm saying? Niggas not in the hood love him. Old people like him. Young, Young people, people like fuck him. with him. Mm -hmm. Females, males. It's all around, bro. White, black, 
Purple, green, it's all around, bro. Aliens. You gotta think, bro. The niggas like forty, making sense for young niggas. <laughs> like, bro, who can do that? Like, all these niggas his age, they to the side. Yeah, man. This nigga's forty years old, still mm -hmm. doing songs mm -hmm. for young niggas. He's the LeBron James of the rap game. For real, that's a great way to put it. That's a great way to put it. It is. An old ass nigga. Playing better than the young niggas. Like, how the fuck? <laughs> how the fuck? Y'all letting this old ass nigga make better songs than y'all, man. That nigga shit... still getting up and down the court like it's shit crazy. Like it's man. nothing. Yeah, man. It's a, cause it's like a lot of young niggas coming out. I hate when uh they try to make old niggas compete with young niggas, but Future can do that though. Yes, he can. Yeah. So he's solid all the way. I give it to him. Pludoski, you know what I'm saying? Mixtape Pluto, you did that shit again. You should probably take a break from dropping songs because I ain't trying to just listen to you all the time, my nigga. I, li I like diversif diversifying my portfolio, man. There you go. There God you damn, go. man. There you go. I gotta there listen go. to these other niggas, man. I ain't trying to just listen to you. But That's how we doing it. Yeah. Perfect show. Thank y'all for watching once again. Y'all could have listened to anything else, watched anything else, but y'all literally took the time to watch this whole video and support your boys. Make sure you share the video, like, comment, subscribe to the channel. DJ320 Crank is here. DJ320 oh, underscore oh, 320, nigga. You always got to interrupt me. We gonna put up a new uh, profile yeah, coming video. up soon. Y'all stay tuned for that. But yeah, DJ three twenty underscore all social media handles. I got one last thing to say. Uh, if you got some Zan, some perks, some cups, you know what I'm saying, Aline, meet me in the back. <laughs> we out. Oh, before he go. Yeah. Before I go. Mm -hmm. The last thing we gonna say. If y'all didn't learn anything from this episode, please, please, please learn this. And listen when I tell you this, trust nobody.